Hi, it's Alice Siba, and I wanted to show you how to take a document in Canva and more quickly change the whole look and feel to a color scheme that you like or designs that you like um, or your, you know, to match your branding and so forth. We're going to use an example of these journal pages that the team, my team at PLR Finders created. Uh, as you can see, we chose neutral colors because it's meant for our customers to go in and like you and work your magic, right? So you can make it however you'd like. We're looking at it in a grid view here um, and we will go over to design and as you can see this is the main page of design um, there's a brand kit that's available to pro users and it does give you a little bit more control because you can add your 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 colors and fonts in there so you always have them but you don't need a pro account to do this. You can use, you can, you know, do it for free. You just may have like a couple extra steps. So you can do, that shows you uh, styles that are fonts and colors. Some are just colors or just fonts. So let's uh, go ahead and do colors. Um, we're going to do it separately this time. Um, and then you just click, you know, whatever you see that you like, you can, you know, test them out as much as you'd like as well, um, is I would recommend if you are selling a printable product where the customer's printing, make sure you pick a color palette that includes white because you do want a lot of white space on the pages so that they're not using up too much ink. You may actually even want to do two sets, right? Where there's more color and not. If you're doing print on demand and shipping products out to your customer, how much color there is is totally up to you. So we're gonna click this and then we see, oh my gosh, it's like ugly and <laughs> it's way too much color, right? So all you do is if you're not liking what you see is you just click it again and it sort of remixes it. And here we come to a spot where there's white background. It's kind of boring and plain, but this is a plain, plain page, right? Uh, the other thing I like to show you is that you notice that this image changed color as well. Now I can't say every image in all these pages uh, is like that you can edit the colors, but we tended to select ones where you can match them to your brand scheme. Obviously you can replace anything you want, but you can change the color of this, this image no problem. Um, then when you want to do it for all the pages, all you do is go to the bottom left here and you click apply to all pages. So we'll look at it in grid view again and we'll see that can't, oh, it's still working I think, or did I, did I do just something? Yeah, it's still working. That's why it doesn't, it's not all there yet. Um, you'll see that Canva is kind of a weird designer. <laughs> <laughs> that you know it doesn't kind of keep a theme it like if you like lots of different colors and different pages it's going to do that for you if you like a more uniform look you're probably going to have to do more uh, edits page by page which you should always look through each page and see what's happened so you know here we would be like that's you know again too much color so let's go back and we can remix this again that's probably a little bit better and if i didn't like the red there or maybe i wanted to make this red then those things can be changed. Um, also, when we want to go back, we can change the fonts. I'll start at the beginning again. You don't have to, you can start wherever you want. Um, so we have a bunch of font sets here. And I'm going to try this one. So it has changed the fonts on here, as you can see. And then you can also do apply to all pages. And it's starting to apply it as you see. Um, and then like have a look at like this page here, for example, you will would need to go and look at it and see, you know, it doesn't quite look the same way it did. It looked way cooler how we <laughs> had it before. So you might wanna just completely change how, how it looks because that, left to right thing doesn't look as good with this font set you can or you can change the fonts specifically but that's really about it but it's a, a real fast way to get 
it done, then you go through page by page and just change the things that you would like to change. It's that simple.